There's some progress on the TDI Toyota so far. It is in there for good and it, it does start up and run. I'll attach a video at the end of this clip. Um, so, interesting, I grabbed these two hoses just from the parts store and they fit pretty, pretty dang good. Granted, I don't have power steering at this point, so I I may add that later, and I'll have to move this this hose a little bit. But if you see here, let's see, these are both Gates hoses, two two eight zero eight and two two seven five five. Those two ran over to here with a seam in the middle and then this is actually the factory Volkswagen lower hose and it goes right curls around the oil filter housing and goes right in there back to the back and just ran the heater core lines here and loop that one around to the back port over there i've got the fuel lines just running over here to the factory filter i did put a an h in the line there and i'm just running the factory toyota pump fuel pump for now we'll see how that works but so far it's working well um, still waiting on some fittings for my turbo, and then I can start doing the intercooler there, kind of fitting it in place. Just found one that fit in between, in between there, and then going to cut out the, the front support there. I kind of marked where I was going to cut it already on either side, and get that in but anyways i was gonna s just go and the i can just fit my fingers behind the uh, vacuum pump and then if we go underneath here the oil pan it's right there the oil plug comes out and about hits the uh, the breather on the front differential but other than that it, it fits in there pretty great plenty of, plenty of clearance and I brought all my VW wiring out right here and then went down behind over the top of the bell housing so most of it's all hidden there. And yeah, other than intercooler piping, getting the turbo mounted and hooked up, it's about about ready to run. And in here I've got all the wiring tucked under the dash. Ended up with the VW ECU is tucked in there, up in the dash, and then my Volkswagen pedals mounted down there. So, that, that's about it. So it's coming along nicely. I'm mostly waiting on the mail be able to have a test drive video here shortly if, if everything goes smoothly. Anyways, thanks for watching.
Got a diesel Toyota.